Serikin. Infidel, you must defeat me if you would win the Grail. Here, in this temple of Aphrodite, we must match sword and shield, strength and skill, until one of us is dead. Okay. Don't know why we can't all be friends. But I wish you for an equal fight, and you do not have a helmet. Therefore, I offer you one that is strong as my own. Wear it or not, as you please. Okay, let's... Why are we moving so slow? I think that's just how it's moving. It's kind of strange. F68. Playlist 68. Pick up helmet. Uh, okay, we can move back. Shield. We just lost our music again. I think I hit him. I think he hit me. Move back. Lunge forward. Lunge forward. Block. Ah, oh, we just got hit. Oh, we just got hit again. Oh, we hit him in the face, though. Arthur, you're overexerting yourself. Slow down. You will lack the strength to fight. Oh, we need to kill him. Yes. The sword feels as heavy as light. Defend yourself with the shield. Uh, I think that's a bad idea. Block. 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 No! You just cut off my legs. You have been hacked to death by a sac Sarakin. I so only hope you will be a better swordsman in your next life. Ah. Uh, okay, so this is the, um... This is the thing that I saw in the Libra X Doctrina. Hold on one second. So you remember a long time ago, I said, hey, I don't want to look at this because I don't want to be spoiled, but I guess this is this. So we have high attack, high parry, great blow high, great blow low, low attack, middle attack. Middle parry, low parry, high parry, retreat. So the A5-2 keys are the blocks, the 7-1 are the heavy shots, and then these are just basic attacks. Your stamina is how long your strength can carry you through the battle. Your similar level at the beginning of the battle can be vary from high to low. Your actions here in the early parts of the game will determine your stamina level when you begin to fight and during the fight. When you fight, each attack you make um, and each blow land upon you will reduce your stamina. Using a great blow attack will draw most heavily of all upon your strength. Using lots and lots of attacks without strategy will drain your strength quickly. Reversing position lowers your stamina a little each time. Both you and this air can arm wearing armor, so even though it looks like some of your blows have hit or that you may have been hit, some have been turned aside by the armor and done no damage. These are glancing blows and do not count as injury. When you are hit and have taken the injury, you will see a flash on that part of your body. If you land a blow and injure the Sarakin, you will see a flash on the part of his body that have been hit. Flash shows you that injury has been done. This also means that this is where you or your enemy now has a weakness. You must protect your wounded areas while trying to strike again at your foes. How the attacks uh, on your numeric pair, as you can see the parries do not change when you switch. Now they did say that they did say that your stamina depends on your actions that you've made in the game. Um, according to my inventory, we still have something called the green apple here, and this is supposed to revitalize us, right? So what if we eat green apple? Nom 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 nom. I mean, we are poisoned after all. The apple's potent spell has relieved your hunger and thirst and given you a new surge of strength. Alas, it cannot stop the poison or the bite from killing you. It can only delay the final end. Okay, so that will hopefully help us um, be able to survive. Right helmet. All right, let's do this. Ow. Back up. Hit him hard. Oh, come on. That was a good shot. Oh, that was a good shot, too. He can hit me, but I can't hit him. That's kind of unfair. Uh, where'd the music go? I need the music. He's blocking everything. Look at this. This is a really hard difficulty that we must be on. The fact that he can block, like, everything. Alright, so we got him. Oh, we got him huge there. Yeah, we need to slow down. Maybe if we back up a little, it'll help. It'll help. Oh my gosh, we're going off the screen. Whoa! I didn't know you could do this. We are like... 
Oh, stop moving. Stop moving backwards, please. There we go. Come on. Why, why can't I hit him? I was a second late there. There we go. How did we not hit him? That was a good shot. That was a good shot. Okay, we got him that time. Okay, blocked. Come on, come on. Heavy strike. Oh, how do we miss? How do we miss? How do we miss? He hit me again. That was just a glancing blow. Come on. Come on. Gotta watch him. Watch how he moves. We need to wait for our energy to come back. Block low? Yes. Oh, he dodged. Hit him again. Hit him again. <sighs> come on. Block low. There we go. Okay, now it looks like he's retreating. Yeah, he's retreating now. Now's our chance. Hit him. Tack low. Why did we miss? Okay, now that time I know why we missed because it blocked, but that time I don't know why we missed. I'm gonna have to put sound of sound in here because the sound seems to keep dying. Oh, I blocked low and he hit me high. Oh, that's not good at all. Hit him hard. Oh, we missed. We have a lot more energy this time now. But it's really hard because I can't I can't move closer to him. So because I can't move closer to him, it's really hard to hit him. Heavy blow. Heavy blow going bomb left. Oh, how do we not hit him? Come on. I don't see a party part that's flashing yet. Oh. Can't mess with the numlock key. Come on, strike. Strike. You must be too tired because... Oh, I got him that time. Okay, I think we ducked under his attack. Okay, we parry that one with the shield. Or parried with the shield. We blocked with the shield. Blocked that one with the shield. Oh, come on. Come on. Come to me. Come to me. Yeah! No! We missed! No! You have been hacked to death by the Sar Sarakin. This may take me a while. To be like... Oh, I said eat shield. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Pick up helmet. Okay. Let's see if we can, uh... Maybe block his first attack. Nope, we cannot block his first attack. What if I just like try to hit him repeatedly like this? Yeah, I know I'm overexerting myself. I don't care. We've done some damage. We hit him multiple times. I can't swing my sword anymore. We're too tired. Yeah, we're too tired. I can't swing my sword. No, we can't swing our sword. I'm trying to block him now. We did him like three times in a row really, really fast. Come on, come on. Come closer. Come on, I had to have blocked that. Ah, oh, he blocked me. Come on. Come on, come to me. Yes, I know I blocked that. Come on, come to me. It's going low. Yes. Come a little closer. 
No, he went high. I should have saw that one coming. Went high again. Attack. I did not hit. Why is he so far away? His attack range seems to be greater than mine. Yes, come on. I had to have hit him there. And he had to have hit me. I got a helmet. Lunge! Black eye, yes. Now return the strike. I'm too tired. Man, I wish they had a stamina gauge. That would make life so much simpler. I mean, I know they had stamina gauges in Quest of Glory. Why don't they have a stamina gauge here? Man, the way he moves, it's... It's like, I, I don't feel like I'm close enough to hit him. I don't know how to walk forward either. Oh, this is the slowest sword fight of all time. Because we can't attack. All right, I'm going to load. Because. Wait, I can't even load. Yeah, I can't load. The game won't let me load. I think I got him a couple times in the chest right there. Oh, he got me. Why do we keep missing? I mean, he was not blocking us there. Yeah, block that one. Nope, did not block that one. He cut us in two. Come on. Hit him. Why won't you hit him? That was a good strike. I knew he didn't block that strike. It was a good strike. Yeah, we blocked that one. Yes! 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 Huzzah! Not as tough as a black knight. You have killed a Serakin in a fair fight, and now his soul transforms into a dove and flies into the sky and vanishes from sight. The helmet disappears. Right, I'm going to save so we can get our music back. Now that the fight is over, the helmet also disappears. Okay. Well, where's the grail? Used up. The stone dove feels oddly warm. Tis changing. By the power of Aphrodite, it turns to a living dove. Within your own very hands. Aphrodite, follow my dove and you shall have your soul's desire. Follow the dove. Follow the dove. It looks like the dove is flying to the... I forgot to make that F70. Oh well. Following the dove. Oh, uh, hello. Aphrodite, where you stand once my priestess is dead. My name was spoken with reverence. My statue and holy of holies were housed within, where only that bare pedestal remains. The last thing my worshippers would see as they left my temple was this leftward spiral upon the threshold, a reminder of life turning ever onwards. As with life, so too does power pass onward. Even gods and goddesses fall prey to the endless cycle. My reign here is ended. I shall never return. You have won the sacred cup by determination and persistence, by cleverness and skill of arms. I surrender to you. But beware, the power of the grail itself will pass final judgment upon your worthiness to possess it. Start where you would start. 
Turn as you should turn, and count the places of the pillars until you reach my secret number. Beneath that pillar you shall find what you seek. Start where you should start. Turn as you should turn and count the places of the pillars? Okay, so this... If we remember the threshold thing, uh, the moon thing, right? Uh, you're supposed to go counterclockwise, which is this way. And you have to count the number of pillars. So that's one pillar. That's two pillars. That's three pillars. That's four. That's five. And then that's six. So it should be here, right? I feel like I should know what you want, but your purpose is not clear. Each broken pillar looks much the same as your neighbor. You must find the right one by your wits. There's nothing but interest. I'm pretty sure it's that one. But what exactly are we supposed to do? There's one pillar. There's two. There's three. There's four. There's five. Oh, there's one way back here. Check pillar. Check broken pillar. Search pillar. Look at pillar. How do you find the right one? Touch pillar. So what are you supposed to do? Like, what is the command you need? Yeah, we'll lose some medallion. We don't have anything. Um... Aye, that is the purpose of your mission. Yes, I know. Must find the right one by your wits. I know what the right one is. At least I think I do. It's not that one. Wait, could this one be one? If that one's one, then the correct one should be this one. All right, I'm going to restore the game. And I'm going to walk over there. And I, I, I apparently missed a direction like what we're supposed to do because I'm not sure of the command okay start where you should start turn as you should turn and count the place of pillar until you reach my sacred author beneath that pillar you shall find what you see so I need to look under the pillar one two wait is that two i'm not sure anymore three four five okay it's got to be this one it can't be the other one it's too far away right so we need to push the pillar the pillar did not move pause and think before your next choice is it this one this one Okay, I, I know it's got to be six. And I know it's got to be from the direction that we went. So which one is it? There it is. I right, it moves. You know, it had to be one of these. I just didn't know how you count the broken pillars. Yeah, I found it! Yes! Yeah, I found the grail! Ah, oh, man. Now that is a tough adventure. One hand barely touches the sacred cup through a tiny gap in the white cloth that covers it. The girl's power pours through you and restores you instantly to perfect health. Aha. You are dazed with the girl's power, but you must recover yourself and find a way out of here. Camelot must be saved before. Wait, what? The thief has struck again. So are you kidding me? Look at us run. It's so goofy run. 
Let's save it here. Stop, Dave! Stop! Come back here! Okay, I know the next screen is a dead end. By all the guards, he will escape. No, not again! Nay, you got spells upon you. His weapon's been broken. Huzzah! Master, Master, mercy. I'm only a poor, miserable wretch. Have mercy on me. Here's your treasure. Untouched. Take it and let me live. I beg you, have mercy. He is a pathetic creature. You must choose, Arthur. Either take up the grail, now in an act of mercy, or draw your sword and slay him. Now, we've been told that this would happen. We've been told that the grail would test us and to kill him might cause us to lose the game so what we're going to do is we are going to show mercy uh get grail by the gods he dared to stab you in the back if not for your male tunic you would be dead at the hands of this foul dog it is time to let the grail decide his fate uh oh. Whoa! <laughs> oh, that's gonna leave a mark. And so he comes to the end he deserves. Wow. Now you must return quickly to find Galahad and return to Camelot. That was. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad we didn't make the Grail angry at us. <laughs> My king, you have won the Grail. Aye, but rise, Sir Galahad, and draw near to king at once. A great power is at work. The Grail has chosen to bring you home in your hour of desperate need. Temple of the Two Gods. The Grail has brought you here, Arthur, and only one god may rule in the kingdom now. The altar of the Christ God awaits its vessel. Cast down your eyes. The radiance of the Grail is too great for any man to see. Oh, the symbol went away. Behold, Mithra has been driven away and the Grail is gone. It has become a healing force that spreads outward, touching every corner of your kingdom. Whoa, it's so bright. The land returns to life. The lakes and rivers and wilds fill once more with clean, fresh water. Camelot is healed. Woohoo! Oh, look at the British ships. You receive Guinevere's praise and adoration as you have well earned. Your knights salute you and the joyous cries of the love and gratitude of your people fills the air. And so you have won through purity of spirit and heart, through skill and strength. No praise is too great. With peace and prosperity return to your kingdom, ye have the time to rest and enjoy the land you have saved. Thank you, Merlin. But though your land is healed, your heart is not, and perhaps it never shall be. Man, that makes me wonder, is there different endings to this game? So if you don't save all your knights or you don't save Lancelot, would you have had a happier end? But unfortunately, the story plays out the same way as in Arthurian Legends. Lancelot taking away your wife from you and tragedy strikes. Guinevere. Why do you forsake us so? And Lancelot, my friend. 
Finis. The end. Oh man, this is a game that's been 30 years in the making for me. Uh, for many of you guys, you may have never heard of this game before, but you know, as a kid, like I said, I only remember two things. You can die a lot and those stupid riddle stones that even to this day, I can't solve. Um, I invite you to uh, go to GOG.com and you know, buy the game. It's like six bucks and try it out for yourselves. Also, if you do get the game, and you do choose not to save certain knights? Comment in the comment box below. I would love to hear what happens if you don't save certain knights in the story. Uh, for now, my name is a flightless bird. We're gonna watch the credits as we always do. I want to thank you for joining me on this journey. Uh, like I said, this 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 game is literally 30 years in the making for me, and to finally see its conclusion uh, makes me really happy. And not just the conclusion, but I'm also very surprised as well to see so much uh, Greek mythology in the game. Um, because I wasn't expecting that. So to have to read about Aphrodite and all of that, I thought was really fantastic. Uh, skill points. Well, you know, not bad. We're 25 points off of skill. Uh, wisdom points <laughs> uh, were much further off than 25 points. And soul points were off by 3. I do not know what those numbers mean. I have no idea. But I do know that this is your story-based gaming channel. I am the Footless Bird. And I can't thank you enough for everything. If you liked what you saw, like, subscribe, hit that notification. Uh, come join us on our next adventure. Uh, I'm playing this game while I'm also playing Hero U and Chrono Trigger on my schedule. Uh, so those two games are being uploaded as I speak. I do not know what our next uh, traditional point-and-click game is going to be. Um, like this, uh, I'm thinking about maybe Robin Hood because I've never played Robin Hood and I hear a lot of great things about it. Uh, but we'll see. Uh, you know, if you have suggestions on things that you would like to see, comment in the comment box below. Uh, it doesn't, it's not just a good idea, so I know what you like, but at the same time, it helps our channel. Until next time, friends of the fightless, I will see you all in the next game. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you would like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more. Also, please do not forget, you matter. You are brilliant and you are loved. And you should always remember to be true to yourself. Don't let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly feathered flightless bird. Till next time.